My uh, older kids all said, you know, this was emotionally unsafe. We just need to kind of step back. We just need to put down a boundary here. But it was never anything about, we don't want to see you again. We don't want anything to do with you. It was about, this, this got yucky. My mom's kids and I have each had our own experiences um, being told directly. I have been told directly multiple circumstances by multiple different people that I was not accepted, that I was not their sister, that they didn't consider or see me that way. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Tough Topic. My name is Brittany. I hope everyone is enjoying their day and I hope everyone got a chance to see episode two of The Sister Wives. And I really just want to recap and highlight some important parts of the episode because to be quite honest with you, there is so much repetition in the same old story that we've heard for the past two seasons. But Robin's kids just got a chance to speak out in the confessional this episode and explain what went south with their siblings and the other moms and why there is such a divide. Now in this clip ahead, it was a scene where Christine was explaining to Janelle what exactly went wrong with Robin's kids and she explains it goes far beyond her divorcing Cody because Cody always uses that as the reason why the family split. But Christine says it was the text thread during Christmas that really set Robin off. And ultimately, Robin's kids wanting nothing to do with them. But Robin says that that's not the case. She says things were said in the message thread and it made her kids very uncomfortable. And in Robin's words, things got yucky. So that set some boundaries. But Robin's daughter, Aurora says that they have been told directly that they were not welcome and they were not considered their siblings. I'm like, wow, who would say that? But I'm thinking like, how long ago was this? Because I don't think any of the adult children would say something like that now. Although McKelty's husband, Tony, did say that Peyton did a lot of bullying even like a few years ago. So it wouldn't really surprise me. But Although they have this rift or this divide, we have heard Gabe say himself that he misses Robin's kids. Like he says, he sees Aurora and he says it's really cordial. It's no hard feelings. Brianna, Robin's other daughter, says that the parents could have done a better job at connecting them as a family. And something tells me that there's some brainwashing being done because unless it was all for show, I personally, with my own eyes, Saw them do a lot of things as a family, going to events, parties, gender reveals, and even McKelty's events. Robin's kids weren't there, though. Like, why didn't they go to her baby shower? Why didn't they go to the gender reveal last year, the one where they were all doing it via Zoom? They were not a part of that. They were being left out. But do you actually think McKelty said, hey, Robin, I'm having this gender reveal online, but... Make sure your kids are not a part of it. No, absolutely not. I believe this is why there is a divide present day. Christine even said that they have been invited to everything, even Logan's wedding that they weren't a part of. But let's move on to Mary. In this episode, Mary explains how she finally opened up her eyes and just cut all ties with Cody. She got tired of just men dragged around despite all the false hope he gave her during the past decade of their relationship. But I'm not going to lie, Cody says some pretty cruel and mean things about Mary. He says that Mary was not a nice person. He says that she was always being cold and angry around him. And he even says that he's happy that she finally opened her eyes and got the hint about their relationship. Fight. I needed her just to go away because it just took forever for her to finally realize. It's been done. Like that is cruel. Imagine Mary and Leon watching that back. But I am so happy that Mary is out of that toxic covenant. 
But Cody also drills in a little bit about Maddie, his daughter. Now, remember last episode, the producers were asking him about Maddie and the relationship, and he said he's not going to talk about it. But guess what? He talked about it. Shocker, right? He says that he has... He says that he has cut ties with Maddie, and when he does talk to her, she's always fishing for gossip. Hmm. Now, Robin does say that she's encouraged Cody to work it out with them, but it's a two-way street. She says Maddie doesn't reach out to him. Cody says he just got tired of uh, the gossip and always just wanting to fish for information. Now, I don't know exactly what information he's talking about. I'm pretty sure... At some point, Maddie will elaborate on that. I don't know on what platform, but I would love to hear a little bit more about that. But Cody does say hopefully one day he can, um, they all can get together and just have forgiveness for one another. But tell me what you all think of this episode if you've already seen it. And let me know in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you won't miss out. Bye for now.